Hello guys, welcome back to another benchmark video. Today I will be testing Metro 2033 Redux. Last year I did do last light Redux and the normal 2033 uh, Metro 2033. So we're just going to be testing um, match. We just the last one we need to test is Metro 2033 Redux. So for FPS monitoring, I am using Cam as my processor. I'm using an Intel Core i5 4460, and my graphics card is an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 750 Ti. You can download cam in the description below or you can click on the you can also click on the logo on the top right corner to learn how to use cam so yeah for that further ado let's get into it all right so options video i'm running it at these uh, settings at the moment because this is a very demanding game so a solution we got is at 1080p uh, quality very high ssaa off uh, texture filtering um, AF 16 times and motion blur we got this off and then um, testation we got this on very high and vsync off now I hear it's best run on high settings and I do agree with that so we will test in both and I will also be testing in 900p and 720p so survival I haven't did I start a game no I didn't let's just start the game the tunnel grew colder Artyom, yeah, that's his name. <laughs> I forgot to put camera, sorry about that, guys. But yeah, the moment we are getting 26 FPS in this cutscene. Alright. Thirty-nine FPS to forty FPS. Open the gate. All right, let's open the gate. Shit is always breaking down. Use the auxiliary hand system to open the gate. I have to hold it. <laughs> so forty-two FPS. We're staying around the 40s to 30s to high 30s FPS. Now, do bear in mind, guys, I am recording, so it takes about 8 to 5 FPS. Found ammo. Uh, found. I believe there's more. Um, just open this. There is some stuff in here. If I, last time I remember. Yeah, this right. <laughs> <I just laughs> Fuck. <laughs> just to save the electric bill. <laughs> All right. Flashlight. So we turn on the flashlight. We get 33 FPS. Now this part was a bit demanding. This part when we go outside here. As you can see, we're starting to drop down to 30 to 28. Gas mask. So as you can see, this was the part that I mean, you get, it does dip down a lot, to 30 FPS, to 28. If I aim down, this is when the depth of field kicks in. If I fire, 27 FPS. But it's still smooth, it's still playable, don't get me wrong. Twenty seven FPS. Yeah. Ooh, twenty five, twenty four. There, all right. It has, <laughs> it has dropped a couple of frames there. So let's just try this. In. Let's put it all in high. It should perform better now. Changes. Okay. Let's see. Yep, as you can see. We have been, it's been improved by a, just a ton. 39 FPS, and this is extra playable. Very smooth. Alright, so let's see. Yep. Damn. I haven't got no ammo with me, dude. I'm gonna die. Oh, 
So 32 FPS, not bad. And it's a smooth, it's pretty smooth. Facility of the tower. Oh shit. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I take it back for what I said to you before. You almost ran me over, you bastard. I'm gonna knock you out. He just comes back. Oh, damn, I miss you. I just punched him in the face. That can be good. Damn, nice. Okay, so as you can see, 1080p, it runs very well, except for very high. There was some slight dip downs we saw there, but again, I am recording, so that it could stay up to 30 to 28. But again, uh, I recommend you play this on high, because very high is just, no, unless you just don't give a crap and you just play it like, like, like you have no problems if it lags or not, then just put it uh, on very high. But uh, yeah, we're going to be testing it now with 900p. So let's see, it should perform much more better now. So, yeah. Let's see, okay. So as you can see, straight off the bat, we are having about uh, 53 FPS, but let's test this with very high. Let's see what, good. Let's see what happens if we do, if we do that. So, yeah, 40 FPS, we put this on very high on 900p. Oh shit, get the fuck out of me. <laughs> I have no ammo, what the actual... <laughs> I have no ammo. Oh, that can't be good. 80 FPS, nice. So it does perform better in 900p and very high texture settings. But again, I like to play it on high, better for better performance. If you're going to play it in 1080p, then I recommend you put it on high. Uh, on 1080p, sorry. So, yeah. There should be music here, but I did turn off music due to copyright, so I do apologize. I hate copyright, I just hate it. But YouTube, you know, just likes the copyright stuff, but oh well. Artyom, <laughs> you're awake at last, I see. Mm -hmm. Hunter's on his way in. He should have news from the other stations. Come on. All right, so. Dun 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 dun. Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop. <laughs> Let's go, Artyom. So it just it does it does dip pass down to forty five. So let's go ahead and put it back. Again, if you want to play this on very high, then I recommend you put this on 900p because it is quite smooth. But I like to play it on high in 1080p. So, Suxi uh, puts that up straight to 74fps, 86fps. Another patrol was attacked last night. The hospital's full. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so in the three we have been getting, we have just gotten a very good result right now in an entropy. Let's go. <laughs> Before the door just opens and it just punched him in the face. 
Oh shit. That guy looks like from the guy from TF2. I'm a big fan. <laughs> How are the wounded? Uh, not much improvement. Two died this morning. God, when will this ever end? I can't reach. This leads to death. Damn. Now, give away from me. So, yeah, we are 97 FPS. Ooh, nice. Now this part was also demanding, so we should see some FPS dip downs here, like maybe to 60 or to 6, yeah around that, 60. What the hell? Who could that be? So 900p, very smooth. Let's try this now in 720p. In 720p, 12 by 720 with all very high, let's see. And for the for giggles, let's put in this. All right. Yeah, as you can see, if we put S A M S M A A, it doesn't sub. It just doesn't like it at all. The nine the seven fifty Ti. So it does dip us down to around twenty two FPS. So if you put this on high on ten eighty P, it's gonna be extra worse. So yeah, SSAA gonna have to be a big no. So I, for me, I always keep it off for better performance. And the forgot motion blur will also have it off. I already said that in the beginning. <laughs> Sorry guys. So 1280p on very high settings. Let's see, steady 6 FPS, nice. Thanks. Now closer, kid. It's been a long time, Hunter. Good to see you, Alex. Hello, Artyom. Hello. So, Hunter, what's happening in the outside world these days? Not much. Most of what I hear is about exhibition and the undead infesting your tunnels. So, 84 FPS. Again, those of you who like to play, you those of you who are on a budget and you like want to get the 750 Ti, then I recommend you get. Uh, oh, thank you. <laughs> So I recommend you get a 900p monitor or a 720p monitor because they will just perform. For me, I recommend you just get a 1280 by 1024 resolution. That's for me. That's the best monitor resolution I c I just ever had in my childhood life. But 1080p is also good. But 1080p is for higher end cards such as the 950 upwards. Also with the 780 Ti, then yeah, you can. I get a weapon. You could have gave me that one instead, you greedy. <laughs> but I'll keep this. So yeah, in 720p, it's very, very, very playable. 92 FPS. I do play games sometimes on 720p, so bear that in mind. Oh, what is that noise? Oh shit. My goodness, you're a badass. I don't need to help you. <laughs> Stand back, foul beast. Oh shit. Oh my goodness, that, that panic attack though. Let me just shoot him. There we go. Oh shit. 68 FPS in gun battle. So yeah, very, very, very great performance on the 720p resolution. We have been getting 80, 60 to 120. Shit, nice. All right, so I want to test this one in 1080p in gun battle like this. For those of you who are wondering, and we will put this back on high. So let's see. Alright, in gun battle like this, 45 FPS and it's smooth. Don't get me wrong, it's not playable, it's very smooth. As long as it's smooth and playable, I'm alright. Are you alright? Of course. It's a dead eye shot this one. Damn well you know it. No dark ones here. 
just the usual tunnel trash. <laughs> He's just chilling. He's like, you know what? I love your benchmark videos, dude. <laughs> he just sits down. I think he's asleep or something. So yeah, guys. Very smooth. I highly recommend. This game does run very, very smooth on a 750 Ti card. On these settings. Um, if you want to play in 1080p, then I recommend these settings. If you're going to play in 1600 by 900 uh, then you can bump up some settings as long as you don't bump up this. If you bump up this, you just lost FPS a lot. So I recommend you have this off. So yeah guys, I thank you very much for watching this video and um, I will, there will be more 950 and 750 Ti videos coming soon. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next benchmark video. Peace out.